Well, that was Chessie, so I haven't done a, <clears throat> a Predator one in a while, so. Here's another trans Predator. Danielle Edney. This person was caught in two separate pedophile stings. He said that he has uncontrollable sexual urges and he wanted to impregnate a teen girl. And you know how all, all these weirdos like to start these side things, you know, fundraisers, all this trust kind of stuff. Well, this one here is a founder of Transgender Trust. Yeah, you'll see how hypocritical that is. So in May of 2022, he was caught actually in a sting, and he thought he was talking to a 13-year-old girl. It was actually a decoy. Managed by the Predator Hunters at Stop Sting. The group explained that he told the girl to make sure she brought her bikini and her school uniform. And he also told her to stop at a sexual clinic to get condoms. So he was actually confronted by pedophile hunters who contacted the police. And this is how fucked up our society is. It just gives the guy's first name, but a man who documents these things, his name was Rob, uploaded the video of the confrontation and the evidence to YouTube and they suspended his channel. So you got someone that's catching predators in the act with the proof and they side with the predator. So yeah, YouTube, you got fucking problems. For hate speech. How is it hate speech when you're caught doing that. Oh my god. So he confirmed he was attempting to meet a 13 year old child. He made the excuse that he seeks out children for sex because of his lack of success with adult dating and also stated that he has a lot in common with 13 year olds. He admitted that he had been previously arrested for impersonating a police officer at a pride parade in West Sussex because he had been carrying police grade handcuffs. I'm a trans woman of God, I'll tell you the truth. Jesus Christ, whatever. So he was arrested on May 14th under that sting, which he was released. I don't know why I do this yawning shit. Now get this, this piece of shit went online and he became vocal against pedophile hunting groups while using the social media handle Sussex Bail Bonds. So he gets caught by pedophile hunters and then he goes online afterward and starts bitching about them. So then in December of 2022, he was caught again by a completely different pedophile hunting group who was actually unaware of his past history. So you have T Steve, who was part of PEST, which is Predators Exposed Sting Team. He led this one against him. This is what he said. When I was initially investigating Daniel Edney, I had no idea that he had been previously stung and reported to the police by another voluntary team until 72 hours before my sting operation. I came across some information online during my research on the buildup to the interception of Danielle and found video footage of Facebook and YouTube Danielle's first thing Steve told Redux. Rob, whose YouTube channel had been deleted, passed his information on to, to the past. So, again, he tried to meet another decoy, but instead was, was greeted by the pest people. During this one, during the confirmation er, conversation, he said he wanted to impregnate someone. When asked why he pursued children for sex, Edney repeatedly insisted that he had uncontrollable sexual urges. He stated that he had never 
had sexual relations before and consumed pornography as well as used sex toys to address his his desires. Because I've had because I've not had sex in my entire life because I have that wrote that wrong. Because I've had not really what you guys have, which is a proper relationship. So he's trying to justify what he's doing because nobody ever had sex with him. And again, this is a trans person. Look what they did. I did there's that trans person that made a little girl freaking perform oral sex on him. There's just so many things. These people are fucking gross is what they are. And right there, pervert. Hopefully someone takes care of him. I wish somebody could explain to me why I do this yawning every time I try to do a video. I can't even not do it anymore. I've tried for the past two weeks to make videos and I can't quit fucking yawning. I don't understand it. I don't yawn at all when I'm not doing this. And then it's just freaking nonstop. I can't stop doing it. I tried to look it up online. This is saying anxiety and shit like that, but I don't. It's kind of dumb. Yeah, I know I'm not sleeping that great, but still. Anyway, that's it. Now you see what I mean by he started a, he's the founder of Transgender Trust, huh? Yeah. I'm sure Joe Biden would definitely probably bring you right on down to the, his, his crew of weirdos. Yeah, that's it. See ya.